What is up guys, it's me, I'm Sea Official Games here and I welcome you guys to Remember Me Part 16. This is right where I left off and without further ado, let's go up this damn elevator. Let's get it. Okay, so I'm walking down the edges, I'm guessing. What is this? Oh, there's robots. Time to kill them. Bop, one for you. How you block that, my G? That don't even make sense. Oh, what the fuck is happening? This isn't cool. <laughs> it's like, I don't give a shit. I got a new combo for you guys, though. Y'all want to see it? I call it that. Ah, right, y'all fucked up now. Yeah. Peace out, cut. Yeah. I don't destruct it like a ball. Ah, right, this seems like the last battle. Like on some Star Wars shit. Like, oh. Even though I never watched Star Wars, but like, you know when he blew up the Death Star or whatever? That's all I do. Because they make so many re references about that. Oh, God. Don't hit me, please. I have a family. Y'all don't, because y'all bitches, but... Ooh, why you shot at a motherfucker point blank range? Ah, this robot getting killed. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Fuck! Now I got no more reason. Alright, what the fuck is this? Nah, 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 nah. We ain't doing that beat. Nah. I, I got, I got a, I got all this shit to see, bro. It's my biggest hell. You will not stop me from watching this, all right? Oh, that's another big fucking guy. All right, bro. You know what I'm gonna do with you, bro? Overload you, bro. I can't deal with big ass motherfuckers. I just get rid of them right off the bat cause like fuck it. Why should I have to deal with all that bullshit? All that drama just for a little bit of clout? Hell no! You're all dead dead. Motherfucker. You're all dead dead. Hey, this sunshine looking good. I'm destroying everything my parents ever fought for. Daddy, guess who's coming home? If any question, why did we die? Tell them because our fathers lied. Kipling. Rudy Yard, Kipling. Okay, Rudy Yard. I must confront my father. Yet my life story is riddled with holes. Shadows upon the canvas of my life. Once I was Nilin, an errorist, feared and hated. Capable of sculpting your memory to my whim. Once I was the adored child of the Cartier Wells, themselves adored by a society they designed. Shadows and light. It's up to me to repair the damage, to right the wrongs committed by my family, whilst chaos threatens to consume it all. It's time for my father to truly taste the poison that the whole world embraced. Edge guides me, and I am ready. Episode 8, we lit, boys. The conception cube. The heart of this corruption. This time we nail it. No going back. Tell me about my father, Edge. Charles Cartier-Wells has walled himself away for years, dreaming of his ideal future. I it's here tell. that H3O was conceived. H3O. Memorize central server. Shit. The place where all these memories are stored. 
Only your father may enter. It's up to you now. Convince him to let you in. Let's get this done. Honestly, though, this this shit looking fancy, bro. I kind of want to switch sides. Shit. Hey, yo, Dada. It's your girl. Oh, shit. That's where everybody's memories are kept. Yo, yo, yo. Oh, she got a tattoo of that. Hasn't she? Nah, who cares? Let's run it. Now she could jump over the ledge, but before, she fucking couldn't. Huh. <laughs> Little smarty, please let me work. Come on, Papa. Come play with us, okay? But just for a little while. Did this motherfucker lose his mind? Or does he know that I'm here? Who's that? Those voices? Your father. He kept many of your childhood memories for himself. It's disgusting. Genius and despair are a dangerous mix. Uh, no, really. They probably kidnapped your ass. He didn't know what to do and he just became psychotic. But, I mean, I don't know. I'm just. Guessing, but so far the storyline is A1. I like everything. Well, there's some shit that got me tight, but you know, there's always that one level that you get stuck and you're just like, what the fuck? Yo, I'm alive, old man. Don't be crying about me, B. I wonder what my making Jax. A Jax. What the fuck is he on about? Hey, yo, dad, it's your girl, boy. All I see are pale fragments of my life. Soundless, tasteless, dull and dead. You'll finish up the family scrapbook later. Charles is close. You're almost there, sis. The nightmare is nearly over. There has to be an error here. Not a mistake. Don't understand. My father. His work is his life. And I'm gonna convince him to destroy it. His work became the only way he could save the life he loved so dearly. What do you mean? Look around you. The power to remove painful memories. To forget a car crash. My God. He did all this for me. And you are the only person in the world who can convince him to bring it to an end. I can fix everything. Fix everyone. Just need a little more time. Just a little more time. Now, give him a taste of his own medicine. Can I talk to him at least, B? I want to talk to him. Damn, bro. This man Edge really controlling the, everything about her, bro. She should have talked to her father. Be like, I, yo, dad, explain this bullshit to me. But nah, she just remixing memories like she had gun. Like he says, shoot, and she shoots. She ain't thinking for herself. Oh yeah, I forgot. I gotta watch it first, then. Yeah. Gotta watch it first, then I get to rewind and do all the changes, boys. Papa, is mommy coming home soon? Very soon, my little smarty. Mommy doesn't like Jax anymore. Since when he was bad. But, but be still now. I'm going to make everything right again. You can't fix Mummy's leg. It's too late. 
Oh, I'll find a way to fix that as well. But for now, I'm going to help my little girl. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, how do you feel? <laughs> do you think Mummy hates Jax? No. Why? Did he do something bad? No. No, he didn't. <laughs> now, run along and play now. Daddy's got work to do. Okay. Love you, Papa. I found a cure for misery. Soon, I'll take all your hurt away, and we can be happy again. And then I'll free the whole world from pain. Oh my god. Nah, but what's the point, bro? It's not if you get rid of mystery by that, you're not really changing anything. Nobody's gonna learn from their mistakes or the or grief. Like if you don't feel grief, how are you supposed to I mean you learn from it. You become a better person through it. Sometimes you get depressed, yeah, but like once you stop being depressed you could actually think of ways to fix it. Or better yourself actually like death is something that just happens like I wouldn't want my memories after I died to be on a machine like just treasure the memories you have while you're alive and after that it's really none of my business man. this is crazy this man was on some, on some take over the world type shit like how did he think this was gonna get it up like he was probably a private scientist Investigating this. Papa, mommy coming, coming home very, very soon. My little smarty. Mommy doesn't like Jacks anymore. Since when? I don't when see when shit that? that I could remix. Not the beast now. I don't see shit that I could remix. I'm, I'm going to make everything right. Again. This is the most straightforward. It's like it's too late. Oh, I'll find a way to that as well. But for now, this shit annoying. Oh wait, I felt something. He said, "Remix the remix." Wait, so she's remixing the memories that he took from her of the car crash. So she's gonna see her own memories, basically, if you think about it, of what actually happened. Don't tell me I gotta remix this bullshit, too, bro. I just did it before. Don't tell me I gotta do it again. Oh, my God. <laughs> I gotta do it again. Fuck my life. Stella, darling, is everything all right? You should have been home hours ago. They started work on the Mary Ferrick. I had to take a detour through New Belleville and traffic was bad. Did you find Jax? Jax! Jax! Yes, I did. And next year, you're the one in birthday detail. Your daughter has been impossible ever since she saw me buy her gift. Can I have it now? Please! I spent the day at the lab. Did you have the time to read Hello, my Papa. memo on Memorial Therapy? Just finished therapy. shopping with Mummy. Hello there, my little smarty. Behave yourself with your mother, promise? Charles, dear, I'm not convinced the clients are going to accept your idea. Storing memories seems like a more commercial argument to me. Can you walk on 
Can you imagine the possibilities? Human memory management. <laughs> I we'll wish talk I about could it tomorrow, that. okay? Right now, I'm thinking it might not be such a bad hungry? idea if your daughter would forget it was her birthday. I'll take some food with us if you like. <laughs> I wondered why it has gone so quiet. I should punish you, my dear, but the two of you are so adorable together. Why do I gotta remix the remix? Oh wait, nah, I gotta go all the way back. Cause if I don't and I mix a bunch of stuff. It's crazy. He played with her. Playing with memories ain't no fucking joke, bro. Like you could really change people's perspective on almost everything, really. Yo, he did that for his daughter though. And she over here winning it. Because some dude that probably kidnapped her told her to. I don't know, bro. Edge to me is. Oh, man. Yeah, just restart the fucking cup holder. Again. Don't know why. Just fucking. Oh, lock that motherfucker. She flying through that. She flying through that. Shield. Break the windshield. Should I repair it? This it makes no sense. Why would I repair it? The red one. You see? Your rug's going to fix out. What the fuck is he doing? friend you're fucking dead even though you're alive bye bye jesus she doesn't even know her full story, that's the crazy part, like, she, she lost her memory, so she doesn't really know who she actually is, but, I guess she died inside of her father's head, but her mother still knows she's alive, so, I don't know how that would work out, because when we saw the mother, we remixed it as well, but, oh, shit.
I shed a side, my dear. child forgive me <laughs> I wasn't naturally gifted I was just a good student you were his experiment Nilan break him do it oh Edge what a tragic waste stop <sighs> what if I don't want to break him You must stop everything, Papa. The experiments, the abuses, the lies. The entire world is dying from an overdose of amnesia and false memories. The horrors I have dug up. Noble an idea. No, Charles. From the very beginning, it was a bad idea. You used your own daughter as a guinea pig. And your wife, too, if I'd let you. You never forgave me. Why are you here today? Because I loved you. And because you're still a genius. There's a civil war out there, Charles. Hate, fear, riots, pain. Everything you set out to eliminate. It's our fault, Charles, and it has to stop. We're nearly there. We must cut the flux relay at its source. Disconnect H3O. The security system is impossible to breach. Unless... It is time! Unless both you and I authorize access. Together. Hey, voila! That's why you sent me to remix them. Only they could authorize access to the central server. Now it's your turn, sis, to finish the job! Access protocol to H3O. Vocal validation. Standing by. Memorize. Hominis Evolucio. Identities confirmed. Access to memorial servers authorized.
You're a better, stronger Cartier Wells than either me or your father. I'm proud of you, my daughter. Here. It's for you. I don't need your memories anymore. When you were little, you often came down here to visit me. These memories will help you find your way. Thanks, Papa. You're welcome, my little smarty. We'll be waiting for you here. H3O is going to be disconnected. You did it, sister. You'll have done in a day what the Errorists failed to achieve in over a decade. But we're still outlaws. With your connections, I wouldn't worry too much. I'm finally going to meet you then. Yes. Follow the remembering that your father gave you, and this will all be over. How am I going to be able to disconnect H3O? Just like any other machine. Edge! Edge! My boy did. Edge! Got to the central memory server. Honestly, guys, <laughs> I'm going to be ending part 16 right here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like. And in the next part, we'll finish this journey.